Hello everybody and welcome back to the new save file. We're jumping in again. I'm gonna go for a regular run just to mix it up a little bit. Um, yeah, I have been recording a lot today. Well, and I mean a lot. <laughs> it's been kind of a record-a-thon. Um, did we unlock Tainted Samson? We did. Okay. Um, we were going to do Tainted Judas before we didn't manage that. I don't know who to go for. I want to go for the Lost, but we haven't unlocked him yet. It's a big sad. Um, let's go for Tainted Lilith. Let's try and unlock Tainted Lilith. But yeah, I am on a record-a-thon right now. I've been recording pretty much most of the day i've done five isaac no this is my fifth isaac episode today which is kind of nutty uh but also it means that i get uh, a long weekend and i don't have to record anything which is really really nice um i, I really enjoy recording but like I feel like, especially with Isaac nowadays, I've, I have I kind of like have some days where I'm really in the mood to play it and some days where I'm not so much. And today is one of those days where I'm really in the mood for it. So I've got to make, a, make the most of it because sometimes I'll get to a point where I have a day where I'm really just not feeling it as much. Oh, it's lanky. It's lanky. Also, evil? Rude? Wait, excuse me? Okay, no, we're fine. Hey, all. We a thin boy. We a thin ass boy. Um, yeah. Uh, and some days I'll I like need to record like I won't have a video prepared and I'm like tough shit. One's gotta go out today, even if you don't really feel like recording it today. And it's it's never like a it's never like a thing where I feel like I have to force myself to do it. If I didn't want to do it, I just wouldn't do it. But like sometimes I'm not as quite enthused as other times. Um, more so is what I mean. Uh, but today has just been, I don't know, very isaac -y day. Honestly, the absolute worst thing about doing recording like this is question of the day, man. I just never, like, it's so hard to come up with five questions of the day. It's so difficult. So I'm kind of lost for what to, what to give for this one. Um, hmm. Hmm. Simple one. What's your favourite brand of drink? I've definitely asked that before a long while ago. Don't remember any of your answers. And there's most likely some new people here since I last asked it. So it's Simple Pimple. Mine, one, one of the drinks, I wouldn't say it's my absolute favourite, but one of the drinks that I really like that there's been some slight controversy around recently is Good Old Lil, which I didn't realise was part of Fanta uh, for a while. And they're now discontinuing Lil and turning it into Fanta Pineapple. And I'm just like, excuse me. It's literally going to be the exact same drink, but I'm like, excuse me. Lil, you can't be getting rid of Lil. It's just not, it's not right. It's not right. Lil is the best. It's like if Mountain D it kind of reminds me of like, if Mountain Dew had a flavor, because do you know how like Mountain Dew, especially the the regular Mountain Dew, just is it just tastes like sugar, like that's all it is. I'm sorry, but if your favorite drink is Mountain Dew, you are basic. <laughs> I'm sorry to say, it just tastes like sugar, um, and it kind of reminds me of Mountain Dew because it's like a Mountain Dew is nice. Um, ooh, child leash is better. Mountain Dew is nice. Um. But, yeah, it just it just tastes like sugar. Um, and, yeah, this guy, Lil kind of reminds me of, like, if Mountain Dew had a proper flavour. And I realise there is other flavours of Mountain Dew, but the UK doesn't really have them. Like, Code Red, never seen anywhere sell that in the UK. Just doesn't exist here. Not quite sure why. Don't know, we... Excuse me, big fucker. Do you want to calm down? I'm on low HP now. That was kind of a travesty. I am a lanky boy. Do you really think you can step to me? And before you say, Lilith's actually a girl. Well, actually, it's Isaac dressed up as Lilith. So how about you shut up? I've got you there, haven't I? 
God damn. I swear. I, 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 I like, this is going to be a, a, a slightly off-tilt rant. I wouldn't even call it a rant, but point that some people probably won't want me to speak about. But one thing that really annoys me, I wouldn't say really annoys me, but one thing that, 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 that slightly annoys me is when, so when people are getting like misgendered, that's definitely wrong. When people are being dead named and stuff like that, you, you shouldn't do that. If it, I feel like if it's a complete and utter accident or you don't know the person beforehand, then you should give them the benefit of the doubt. But if they've been told and they consistently are saying it wrong or doing it on purpose because they either don't respect your gender or don't respect you, they're completely understandable to be pissed off. But one thing that does annoy me is sometimes people will get like their panties in a complete twist because I'll misgender a fucking dragon in a video game. It's like, it's a... It's a random, made-up character, and I called it a he by accident. Does it re- like, it's not offending the dragon, don't worry about it. The dragon doesn't even know you exist because it can't, because it's a piece of curd with a sprite. <laughs> it's like, uh, I, I just, I, I find it's just a very strange hill to die on. Also, by talking about dying on hills, uh, <laughs> this is about to be real fucky wucky. Uh, it's like, I kind of understand their point, you, you, like, it's just the general practice of making sure you don't misgender people or things. I, I kind of get that general point, but like, to get like, deeply offended or annoyed by it, which I have seen, yeah, we died. Uh, which I have seen, by the way, I have seen, like, people in my comment section or just on the internet get really offended because someone misgendered a random video game. Like, if it's a video game character that is clearly a man or a woman. That's, that's whatever. But when it's like a random dragon or like a spider or like some little creature that is very, like, it, it, like it's not clear at all what gender it's meant to be. Or even if it is like, even if her name's like Queen something or other, but it's just a fucking bug. It's just, it's just a strange hill to die on in my opinion. And I'm sure this is a bit of a rant that some of you may disagree with. And it's like I said, I kind of get the point because it's just a general idea of making sure not to misgender, but... It's never something that had, that had ever be done maliciously. And it's it's definitely like a, a sort of bad habit of mine. And I obviously one that over the past few years, I've been trying my best to correct. But sometimes I will just call things in games, dude or him. And it's, it's sort of, it's sort of just a default. It's not really me specifically commenting on their gender. Anyways, enough about, enough about this. Oh. Some spicy air wasers. Soul of Maggie. Alrighty then. This is definitely a room for this. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I would like some more bombs because I'm going to imagine those other, uh, other air wash runes. Other runes, sorry, are air wash runes. So I would like some more bombs to take advantage of that. Come on now. Don't be like this. Right, back we go. Okay, okay, okay. Damn it, I tried. I tried. Didn't work. Big, big oof. Shouldn't have wasted that air was. It's okay though. It is what it is. It is what it is. Yeah, like, another thing, I, I, again, I don't want to harp on this point too much, uh, unfortunate, but we'll take it. Um, I don't want to harp on this point too much, just because it's a sensitive subject, and I'm sure plenty of you don't care about my views, um, and it doesn't really matter anyways. But one thing that happened to me the other day that I, I don't particularly like people doing, that I see on the internet far too often, 
Um, I, I wrote a, a message about someone um, and I referred to them uh, properly as her in every single aspect of the sentence apart from one instance where I accidentally said he. And immediately someone jumped on and was like, don't misgender them, don't be transphobic. I'm like, excuse me. That is... I don't know if they were like just trying to be facetious and kind of joking around about it, but I still not a nice thing to joke around about and I didn't like it and it's just like it's it's clear it's clear that I understand what their gender is and like I wasn't trying to intentionally misgender them by typing he the one time I just it was just a mistake also not an excuse but I am dyslexic so reading back my own writing and understanding it is not a strong suit of mine not going to use it as an excuse but I kind of also am <laughs> I kind of just did Ooh, hello. Oh! Gotta run to stand still when those things fire at me. It's the bomb, fellas. Hopefully we get some cool tier effects for Lilith here today. I'm hoping we get some more bombs so Dogtooth can be actually useful here. Let's use your active out without having a charge, resulting in negative charge. Having negative charge reduces your movement speed and shot speed. I'm going to take a gamble here and go for both of these. Because I think being able to negative charge our active on, like, the beast fight sounds really, really useful. <laughs> that sounds, like, amazingly good. So I will take... And also, obviously, Sin Robes is just pretty fucking good. Also, our character is looking mighty devilish right now, and I kind of love it. Thank you for the bomb, finally. I just got to remember I actually have that item now. Uh, heart container, yes please. Range, why not? Are you gonna... Can you, can you get out from there? You make an unpleasant noise, good sir. There you... Oh, okay. Guess not. <laughs> I was gonna say, there you go, you're getting out the rocks. Nah, he's just fucking off. He's had enough of my bullshit. And he is fucking off. Ah. <laughs> right. We did get a morbid heart here as well, which is nice. Item room, unfortunately. A little bit away. We've done boss rush, yeah, I gotta say. We've definitely done boss rush. Good, good, good. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, more bombs that I can't get. God damn it. Need flight. That was evil. That was just horrible. I was like, when's he gonna pop up? When's he gonna pop up? Oh, he just popped up directly under me. Oh! God damn, I'm making some slightly sexual noises here, and I apologize about that. Pretty decent, pretty decent. Again, another reason to use a bomb without actually having any bombs. I like Haunted Rose. It decent, it good. Yeah, give me an unlimited supply of bombs, please. I would very much love that. Right, down to the next floor. Haven't been going alt path all that much recently, but I don't know, we've had our objectives in mind, we've been getting unlocks. I think it's been going reasonably well. Unfortunately, we get an Excel flaw here, which I wasn't really looking for. Don't like where you're stood right now, good sir. Unfortunately, getting hit quite a bit. Rooms like that are so funny. When the grimaces just, like, don't get chance to start firing by the time you've already disabled the traps. Just like, okay. Fine, I guess. These enemies can be really annoying. Dunt, dun, 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 dun. I think after this, I'm going to head out to the shop, get myself a drink, and then I've got some late work meetings today. I've got a meeting at 8 p.m. Ugh. 8 p.m. 
bit of a laity, but it's for a good reason, and I actually am the one that suggested it, so I can only blame myself, but it's for a good reason. I work with people in America, which means that the time zones are a bit fucky-wucky, and it's a little difficult to uh, organize things properly sometimes, so... means that late night is sometimes better. Let's find out what the hell the Kapala effect actually fucking is, because I still don't know. And we never will. Oh wait, is it just that every enemy's taking damage at once? It is, yeah, okay, that's pretty nice. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, I do wish I had the ability to fly. Slightly annoying that I don't. Also, give me a fucking bomb that I can use, please, game. It's really screwing me on the bomb front right now. I love the fact that, that poison bomb just kills all of us instantly. That's perfect. Don't really know what you guys do when you're all... Pet Another fucking bomb that spawned as a troll bomb. Because the, the annoying thing about that is you might be like, Oh, well, you got a troll bomb there, there. No, I got a real bomb... I got, a, I got a bomb drop for completing that room, and it has like a 10% chance to turn into a troll bomb, and that happened twice in a row. It's like, this is just taking the piss now. I asked for bombs, and this is what you do to me. Just offensive. Egregiously offensive. Real good. I'm gonna take that right just for now. I, I really like Child Leash and it's gonna be really, really strange to play without it. I'm already feeling not having it, but it's just such a good, um, such a good active, uh, active, uh, trinket to be able to reroll our items. I feel like I have to take it. This game can fuck off. <laughs> So many bombs wasted. It's just like, come on now. This is horrible. Didn't even trigger on this floor. I mean, it's a it's a familiar nonetheless. But I'm I'm sad to the nth degree here. And this is an XL floor as well. So I tr this trinket doesn't even really matter on this floor. This this really that's just hella depressing. Oh, my feeble little brain is having such a hard time right now. I don't like this run. This run, stinky. The game won't give me any fecking bombs. I keep getting hit. My items are bad. I haven't got any familiars. I haven't got any tier effects. I just feel poor. <gasps> and as soon as I say that, the game finally... Give me what I need, and it just gives me more fucking keys. It's not what I wanted. Not what I wanted, really. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm going to lose some charges here. This is just horrible. <laughs> this run is so gross. I objectively hate this run. Ain't giving me any bombs. My items are kind of dookie. My health is bad, because I keep getting hit. My damage is bad. Oh, it's not terrible, but it's, it's not great. You keep spawning bloody pooters that I can't see, that's fair.
Nope. That runs trash. Get it away from me. Don't want anything to do with it. That run is big stinkers. Rare that I'll do that, but Lilith... Lilith is on another level of poo-poo sometimes. Another level of poo-poo. Just gross. That run offended me. And then reverse of the tower made it so I couldn't even pick up my boss item. Just I feel personally attacked. Really wish I'd saved my active for this. Really wish I'd have saved my active for this. Ooh, I got hit again. What a surprise. I'm just, I'm going to be a little bit quiet here because I'm just contemplating life in general and the, the cruelness that is the world we live in. If you don't give me some good items here, I will throw down. Ugh, God, what's with all these massive fucking rooms? Calm down, game. It's only a Lilith run. Don't have to be this way. Ugh, what is this? Is this an Excel floor? No, it's not. It's just a regular old floor that takes 17 years to get through because there's like 8,000 large rooms all leading nowhere. Just gross. Just gross. Oh, look, it's bombs. Look, honey, it's bombs. Okay. Keep it moving. Still. Literally no idea where my item room is. I feel like I kind of explored everywhere, but apparently not. Where did I miss? This way. This is the way I missed. Okay, this guy's firing tears at lightning speed. Oh, I can't do it. My brain, it's too small. Not, not what we're looking for at all, game. Oh, this one's looking like a stinker as well, I think. Too many big rooms. Bad first item. It's not a terrible first item, but bad pill? No, range up, okay. Bad boss. It's all a bit gross so far. I tried to end his attack early there, it didn't, didn't work. Just shut up with your little babies, no one cares. I mean, that's good for gulping a hell trinket, I will say. Infested? Infested? I very much like a, a gulped child leash. That's the first good thing that's happened this episode. I can be happy about that at least. Now I don't have to make the tough decisions I made last episode. Get your head away from me, bah. Very hungry at the moment. I've been eating very low amounts of calories to lose weight, but it does mean that I'm often quite hungry. But it's it's good though. I've definitely uh, I've lost a good amount of weight, and also I've definitely noticed I'm pretty much unable to eat the same amount of food I used to eat on a regular basis, which is very good because it means my my stomach is actually kind of shrinking back down to a regular size rather than completely overstretched. And ridiculous like it was. So it means it takes less to fill me up. Right, this better be good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. There's hope for this run yet. There is hope for this run yet. 
Just, yeah, having multiple of these guys with uh, Tech Zero seems good. Oh, okay. Interesting take on this. Unfortunately, I can't get back there. That was just a little torture chamber for that guy. I'll do both, why not? Sadly, that was an egregious error once again. So many egregious errors today. Don't know why, but that's like my word of the day. Egregious. Remember when this thing did like 100% damage with the laser? God damn it was overpowered. It does like 30% now, I think, and it's still really strong. If you can get it with spectral piercing, it becomes godlike. It's already good. Soul Heart, just for clearing a room. Is it my birthday? What's happening? What is happening here? Ow. Just boshed right into that guy. Still, so many rooms between us and the boss. It's only the second floor. Just chill out, game. Ah! I wasn't expecting you to jump there. God, even though that's literally what you do. I still wasn't expecting it. God. Okay. Right. Keep, mo keep it moving. <clears throat> that enemy just insta-died. That was pretty funny. Got enough for a shop, if you want to check out a shop real quick. I think I will. I think I will. Could get like a 9 volt or something. Or whatever the hell this is. Item prices will fluctuate between 0 and 2 times their price. Touching an item when not having enough money will make the item disappear. Seems kind of interesting. Oh god. I didn't realise they'd fluctuate that quickly. Might not be great. Oh yes, I got hit. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. My little chilly babies. Tears up at least. Check the devil deal out. Wow. Oh my god. That was so generous of you, devil deal. I can't believe it. So thoroughly depressed. This run has, has truly demoralized me to my very core. Lilith. Why can't you have special tiers drop more often so that I can have more fun? Would be pretty cool. <laughs> At least if I get any more familiars, our, uh, st our static tiers will um, link up. Which they wouldn't normally do, I don't think, without the mod. Just a damage and tiers all lead to quite a bit of depression right now. It's like seasonal depression, but for Isaac. Just Isaac depression. Everyone's had it. Everyone's been there. We need a support group. Have you ever had a run like this? Sounds like a, a sort of made-for-TV advert. Have you ever had a run like this? We know the people for you. Have you ever been on the womb with 3.5 base tears as Isaac? 3.5 base damage as Isaac? Well... You're not alone. There is a place you can call home. And it's just people like telling stories about their worst runs on Isaac. This one time is tainted lost. I got rock bottom and died in the next room. <laughs> and it's kind of like an alcohol anonymous sort of thing where it's like, Hi, I'm Jeremy. And I died on basement two as a Zazel. <laughs> That'd be so fucking funny. That's like, that's like a fucking great sketch idea. It'd be so funny. It'd be very, very niche and specific to Isaac fans, but still, I think it'd be hilarious.
I am Susan, and I got in or I in my first item room, and no tears up for the rest of the run. Ah, oh, what are these rooms? These rooms make me want to just end everything. Just please, give it up. <laughs> Stop it with your strange frog noises that don't really sound like frogs at all. Is that not it? What's left? How is there more of you? Where's your shit brain? There it is. Whew. This has been something. Tell me about your, uh, everyone in the comments needs to answer, needs to like, reply to the comment in the style that I was just saying, where you're like, hi, I'm so-and-so, and this was my worst Isaac run, and you just talk about your entry to your worst Isaac run into the, uh, what would be the analogy for AA, for AA, for like, is that Alcoholics and Alcoholics Anonymous, it'd be like, I don't know what, it, what it'd be. So we need to come up with a name for this. We could start a Discord channel on my, on my Discord server for everyone's depressing Isaac runs. That'd be so funny. Why aren't you dying? I realize it's electric versus electric, but don't be mean. Two bombs. Nice. Where's my item room at? I need to see if this run's gonna make me even more depressed. Give me Seraphim. Seraphim I would take in a heartbeat and be very, very happy with. But you watch. I'm not gonna get Seraphim. I walked right into that. Just zero regard for my safety. Kill this guy if I can. My damage. Oh my damage. It is rough. This is this is what five Isaac episodes in a in a day do to a man. Luckily my brain kind of plays Isaac on complete autopilot nowadays. So I make I make a lot of mistakes that way, but it means that I don't really have to think about what's going on. It just kinda happens. It's it's quite nice. <laughs> Isaac's got that relaxing feel to it because of that. Don't like all the bubbles around right now. Bubbles and clouds. It's all a bit much. Oh god, things are taking so long to die. It's a familiar, but it's one that I don't particularly like. People have explained it to me before. I'll, I'll be honest, I still really don't understand how to effectively use it. I kind of get what it does now. Um, I still don't really know how to use it. It just doesn't seem like a quality 3 item in any way, shape or form to me. It seems like maybe a quality 1. Basically, you do that. And it enrages things, and they'll fire at each other and stuff, and they'll do things. And I, I can't remember. I can't, I can't be asked to take the time to learn. Oh, little brim, yes. It's all coming up roses for us, baby. We got a little brim. Okay. Oh, god. Is this run any better than the last one? I'm gonna I'm gonna st say that it's probably an outstanding no. One second. Also, by the way, for any of you that are still watching this this descent into pain and madness, which I'm sure there's still a few of you out there that are loving it somehow. Um. 
If you aren't subscribed to my second channel already, go and give it a sub. But also, even if you don't want to sub, go and check out uh, the channel because I've just re-uploaded all of my Half-Life 1 series with Never Named and my Half-Life 2 series with Never Named. I uploaded all of Half-Life 1 um, onto this channel and a sum of Half-Life 2, but I never got around to actually finishing uploading it. But the full thing is now available to watch. Um, and Portal 1 and Portal 2 are coming shortly. Don't know how shortly. Haven't finished recording Portal 2 yet. Recorded Portal 1 about a year ago. <laughs> but I'll upload those soon. So if you're not sub sub to the second channel already, or you don't know about it, go and check it out. It might be in the description. If it's not, it's definitely uh, on my channel somewhere. We'll figure it out, I guess. But yeah, go and check it out. I upload Elden Ring there at the moment, sparingly, but every now and again, whenever I feel like playing it. It's just basically my second channel for those of you that weren't here when it was made. It's just kind of made for me to upload the odd videos that don't really fit on the main channel. I, like I said at the minute, I'm playing Elden Ring on there. Uh, I'm going to be starting up a Pokemon series on there pretty soon. I've already recorded an episode, but I, I want to record three or four episodes before I start uploading it, just so I've got a little bit of a backlog. Um, oh my god. Don't like that. It scares me. I don't think that item's very good for fluctuating stock. If it's fluctuated a little slower, and you could maybe grab it when it was best price, then yeah, but if you touch it when you can't afford it, and it disappears, big sad. This is going to be where everything changes for us. The fall and giving us a devil deal item. It could all come together right now. I mean... Double ease nail polish is pretty interesting and holy light. Okay. So I'm not I'm not entirely displeased here. I'm not entirely displeased. That's pretty good going. Still taking a lot of damage though. What the hell's going on right now? Ah, fuck! What's happening? Okay, this run's still trash. <laughs> I thought maybe those two items could could fix things. Turns out I was incorrect. Oh, for fuck's sake, I forgot about the brimstone. It didn't do the warning symbol. I'm trying to play it safe here. I'm trying to stay as far back as I can with uh, my brimstoneies. Just chill back over here, brimstone away. It's working reasonably well, but it's kind of hard to hit. Oh, there's still one of these guys jumping around. That's close. I didn't even realize. Almost stood in the creep there. Oh, baby. Don't remember what you guys do. We do kind of need that trinket, so I should probably take it. What? Oh, God, I'm getting caught on the wall. Not the walls, but whatever you call it. The floors. The gaps. The holes. A heart. Beautiful. Beautiful. We'll take that as our trinket to drop in the item room. If we make it that far, that is... Oh, I see. I've just released the beast. Let's do this now while we have a charge. Oh, God. This is about to be awful. Yeah, I'm not. But I'm not good at dodging this guy at the best of times. Shouldn't be too bad though. Managed to dodge the bike. Oh, although this phase is yeah, very bad. Okay, well then that was a that was an episode of Isaac. What? What sort of fucking noise was that? What the fuck? Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.